Elle McPherson, the iconic Australian supermodel, seemed to have it all. Stunning beauty, a successful career, and a fulfilling personal life. She was a household name, gracing the covers of countless magazines and walking the runways of the world's most prestigious fashion shows. Her life was a whirlwind of glamour and excitement, filled with travel, fame, and the adoration of fans worldwide. But in 1999, her world was shaken to its core when she received a life-altering diagnosis, breast cancer. This news was not just a medical condition, it was a seismic shift that threatened to upend everything she had worked so hard to achieve. This terrifying news came as a complete shock, forcing her to confront her own mortality and reevaluate her priorities. The diagnosis was a stark reminder that no one, not even a supermodel, is invincible. It was a moment that brought her face to face with her deepest fears and insecurities. The diagnosis was a type of breast cancer called HER2 positive estrogen, receptive intraductal carcinoma, a form of non-invasive cancer that starts in the milk ducts of the breast. This specific type of cancer is known for its aggressive nature, making the diagnosis even more daunting. The medical jargon and the complexity of the condition were overwhelming. Ella had to quickly educate herself about the disease, understanding the nuances of her diagnosis and the various treatment options available. It was a steep learning curve filled with medical consultations, second opinions and a barrage of information. Suddenly, the future seemed uncertain as McPherson grappled with the implications of this diagnosis and the daunting journey that lay ahead. The path forward was fraught with challenges, both physical and emotional. She had to navigate the complexities of the healthcare system, make critical decisions about her treatment, and prepare herself for the battle ahead. Faced with the overwhelming fear and uncertainty that accompanies a cancer diagnosis, she knew she had a critical decision to make about how she would confront this challenge and fight for her health. It was a moment of reckoning, a time to summon all her inner strength and resilience. McPherson's initial reaction was a mixture of disbelief and fear. The news was surreal, almost like a bad dream from which she hoped to wake up. She found herself questioning everything, from her lifestyle choices to her future plans. Like many facing a serious health crisis, she questioned everything, grappling with the, why me? The uncertainty was paralyzing and the fear of the unknown loomed large. She had to come to terms with the fact that her life would never be the same again. Her world, once filled with glamorous photo shoots and exciting opportunities, now centered around doctor's appointments and treatment options. The contrast was stark and jarring. The glitz and glamour of the fashion world seemed a distant memory as she faced the harsh realities of her medical condition. The gravity of the situation began to sink in as she realised the potential impact this diagnosis could have on her life, her career and her loved ones. She had to consider the emotional toll on her family and friends, the potential disruption to her career and the long-term implications for her health. But McPherson, known for her resilience and strength, both on and off the runway, refused to let fear paralyze her. She drew on her inner reserves of strength, determined to face this challenge head on. She knew that she had to be proactive to take control of her health and her future. Instead, she resolved to face this challenge head on and take control of her health destiny. She embraced a holistic approach to her treatment, combining traditional medical therapies with alternative practices. She focused on maintaining a positive mindset, staying physically active, and surrounding herself with a supportive network of family and friends. This journey was not just about fighting cancer, it was about reclaiming her life and redefining her sense of self. 
Following her diagnosis, McPherson consulted with leading oncologists, seeking the best possible advice and expertise available. These top medical professionals recommended the standard course of treatment for her type of breast cancer, which is a well-established protocol in the medical community. This typically involved a combination of surgery to remove the tumour, chemotherapy to target any remaining cancer cells, and radiation therapy to ensure that the cancer does not return. While these treatments have proven effective for many breast cancer patients, they also come with a host of potential side effects ranging from mild to severe. Some of these side effects can be debilitating and long-lasting, affecting patients' quality of life significantly. McPherson, deeply concerned about the potential impact of these aggressive treatments on her body and overall well-being, found herself at a crossroads. She was not only worried about the immediate side effects, but also the long-term consequences on her health. She questioned whether enduring the harsh side effects of conventional treatments aligned with her personal values and beliefs about health and healing. The idea of subjecting her body to such intense treatments was daunting. The decision to deviate from the conventional medical path was not one McPherson took lightly. She spent countless hours researching, consulting with various experts, and reflecting on her own beliefs and values. She understood the risks involved in rejecting treatments that had become the gold standard in breast cancer care. The fear of the unknown and the potential consequences of her decision weighed heavily on her mind. However, after much soul-searching and research, she made the courageous decision to forge her own path toward healing. This was a path that resonated more deeply with her personal philosophy and understanding of health. McPherson felt strongly that blindly accepting a treatment plan without fully understanding her options or exploring alternative approaches was not the right choice for her. She wanted to be an active participant in her healing journey. She believed in the power of the human body to heal itself and was determined to find a more holistic approach, one that would support her body's natural healing processes. This approach would address not only the physical aspects of her illness, but also her emotional and spiritual well-being. She sought treatments that would nurture her entire being, not just target the disease. This decision marked the beginning of her journey into the world of alternative medicine and her quest for a more personalized and empowering approach to fighting cancer. She began exploring various holistic treatments, including nutritional therapy, acupuncture, and mind-body practices such as yoga and meditation. McPherson found that these alternative treatments offered a sense of control and empowerment that she had not felt with conventional treatments. She felt more connected to her body and more in tune with her own healing process. The journey was not easy and there were moments of doubt and fear. However, McPherson remained committed to her path, drawing strength from her belief in holistic healing and the support of her loved ones. Her family and friends played a crucial role in her journey, providing emotional support and encouragement. They respected her decision and stood by her as she navigated this challenging time. McPherson continued to educate herself about various alternative treatments, constantly seeking new information and insights. She attended workshops, read extensively, and consulted with holistic health practitioners. Through this journey, she discovered the importance of self-care and the profound impact it can have on healing. Practices such as meditation, mindfulness, and proper nutrition became integral parts of her daily routine. Over time, McPherson began to feel a sense of peace and acceptance she embraced her journey with an open heart, trusting in her body's ability to heal and the holistic path she had chosen. 
Today, McPherson shares her story to inspire others facing similar challenges. She advocates for a more personalized approach to cancer treatment, one that honors the individual's unique needs and beliefs. Her journey is a testament to the power of self-belief, the importance of exploring all options, and the strength that comes from making informed, courageous decisions about one's health.